y'all want the tea on how to get yourself one of these bad boys, then keep on watching. Hi guys! So I recently went to Shawn Mendes the tour and I managed to get myself the free reusable Shawn Mendes branded water bottles and I wanted to go over everything with you guys on how you can get one yourself, things that I wish that I knew in advance um, and things that I did to get myself one of these bad boys. So the first thing I want to go over is that I did ask people in line, as soon as we were in line I asked them if they knew where the water bottles would be um, and nobody had any idea. Some people said it was like a scavenger hunt, other people said that it was just randomly put somewhere and you had to go and find the booth. Um, some people said that they just didn't have any idea. So it was very mixed feedback by asking um, the people in line. I also took the time to go to Twitter where I said, you know, I'm going to my show. How do you get these water bottles? Like, where are they? Are they at the, at the merch booth? Is it as soon as you walk in the door? How do you get them? Because each show supposedly only gets 50 of them. I did talk to someone in line behind me once we found the booth for this and she said that her friend was working the booth and that they actually got a hundred extra of these. So our show in Pittsburgh actually had a hundred and fifty water bottles supposedly via someone running the stand. If that information is correct, I have no idea. All I know is that I got one, so I'm good to go here. I didn't know if it'd be the first 50 people to get their ticket scanned, got handed one, if it was the first 50 people to buy a piece of merch, got handed one, because I didn't know how that would work because there's various entryways, obviously, to get inside the venue. There's various merch booths throughout as well. Then on Twitter, I found a tweet um, by Reverb, I believe, that said that these would be at the water filling stations in the venues that Sean would be visiting. So I went to my box office ticket booth inside the venue. So hopefully your venue will be open or you'll be able to contact your venue, get them a phone call beforehand. Um, and all you got to do is ask where the water filling station is. So I actually didn't know about that when I got up to the ticket booth, so I simply just asked her if she knew how fans got the free water bottles. So she looked up all of her information for the show that night. They have a pamphlet that has all the information of the little festivities that they're doing for the uh, event. And there was a blurb that said, the water filling station will be located in section 107 of my venue. That does not mean it will be in section 107 of your venue. Your venue might not even have a 107 section. But she said that the water bottle station would be in section 107 and that fans would be able to refill their water bottles and get water there. So sure enough, we uh, stood right by the little gate entry for that section and ran up those stairs. Let me tell you, I booked it up those stairs. And uh, sure enough, there was already a crowd of people going there and I got in line and I got myself one of these free water bottles. First thing would be to either ask the people around you or to call your venue. You can call them up to two days in advance. Usually they'll have all their information ready, all the like items that are allowed in, all the stuff that's going to happen. Where's the water filling station? I'm looking to get one of the free water bottles that's going to the shows. Um, they're limited quantity and they should be able to tell you where the water filling station is in the venue. Every venue has a water filling station to my knowledge. It doesn't really change like each show. There's obviously going to be drinking fountains and places where you can fill up water bottles or refill plastic cups. It shouldn't be that hard for a staff member to tell you where that station is. The little booth has a guitar on it um, so you can go ahead and actually uh, somehow enter a raffle to win like an autograph Shawn Mendes guitar. I don't know how that works. I didn't ask her. They'll have little tablets right there and all you gotta do is put in your email address, your first name, and then your zip code. Once you hit submit, um, you just gotta accept the terms and conditions or whatever and then it'll say um, you're done and then they'll be like thanks for signing up, here you go, and they'll just hand it to you and it's that easy. The thing you are signing up for is just for a greener earth. It is for the Reverb organization. That's who collaborated with Shawn Mendes to create these water bottles along with the Nalgy um, 
which is the brand of the water bottle. Reverb is the organization that's giving out the water bottles, and then Reverb is working for Shawn Mendes' tour, so hence the Shawn Mendes tour. The only way to get these water bottles is at these shows. These are not available on Sean's merch site. These are not available on the Nalgy website either. So you can only get them at the show. These are just plastic water bottles. They do just have a twist top. On the back, it does say reverb.org. It says hashtag rock and refill. And it says Nalgene. And then it says made in USA. A thousand milliliter so this is great you are allowed to fill these at the venue as well so that's great if you don't want to have to pay for water or a gatorade run in get one of these open it up fill it up with water and then go and enjoy the show and stay hydrated i think that that's absolutely amazing it's ridiculous to pay five dollars for a water inside a venue if you guys have any questions please let me know in the comments down below but these are the important tips to remember, the first tip would be call your venue two days in advance. Simply ask them where their water filling station, what section their water filling station is located in, and what gate you need to go at to get to that section. If they ask you any questions, just explain that there is a limited, free, reusable water bottle being passed out at the show, and you're trying to find out how to get your hands on one. If that fails, the second thing to do would be to try and get to the ticket booth if this is inside or outside the box office. Um, usually the doors to the box office will be open before the um, concert starts and you can go in there early. The last thing to do I would recommend would be asking security. Um, ask a security guard. They have little walkie talkies and stuff. They can walkie to someone and ask them about it and they'll be able to investigate and tell you what section that is in. The reverb booths are completely black curtained and they are by the water filling stations. So if nobody is able to tell you where the water filling station is, look for the signs throughout the venue. There should be, um, it should be written on one of the signs, just like the restrooms and the sections are put on the signs. One of them should say water filling station and you're gonna wanna head there. The last tip I have is if you see a bunch of people running for a certain sec or a certain area as soon as you get inside, I would follow them because 90% of the time they're going to get these water bottles. The last thing I want to mention is at some shows, I guess the VIP is somehow able to go ahead and claim these. So I cannot guarantee that even if you follow all the steps and you find out where the water filling station is and you are the first one there that you will still get one. I've seen VIP videos and there's so many people in the room. There's definitely over 50 people. So if they do go and claim the water bottles, there will not be any left over. But since our show had 150, maybe your show will have 150, I don't know. Hopefully you guys will be able to get your water bottles and hopefully this video helped you guys out. Again, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below. Have a great and safe time at your show. Stay hydrated and go for a greener earth. I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Peace out, Girl Scouts.